Okay, so uh, people that attended PyCon SK last three year probably remember me. Uh, I'm organizing PyCon PL. So uh, this year there will be the 10th edition of PyCon PL. Uh, it's one of the oldest PyCons in Europe and also in the world. It's the sixth oldest PyCon in the world. So we plan to ha have a very good edition because of the 10th anniversary. Uh, it will happen in Ossa, so the same venue as last year, uh, in mid-August. So it's not a typical day for PyCon PA because it was last year uh, during October. So uh, Ossa is one hour from Warsaw, and there will be conference buses going straight to the hotel from the uh, airport uh, of Warsaw, which is very close to the center. So how to get from Bratislava to Warsaw? You have different options. And the good thing is that there will be a direct flight uh, from June uh, from Bratislava Airport to Warsaw. So uh, the hotel, Ossa, uh, is a very big venue. It can even fit uh, 1,000 people. And during PyCon PL, uh, you will get loose of many calories uh, walking around this venue. We'll have six plus plus tracks because uh, this year we are introducing PyData tracks, uh, but we are not sure yet how many of them will be. There will be also lightning talk sessions, and we are expecting over half thousand attendees. And it's important that the full ticket includes hotel room and meals. It's, it's kind of different when you compare to other events. Uh, so call for proposals will start by the end of May, uh, of March, sorry, of March. So you can propose talks, workshops, and any other activities you will uh, f uh, think about. So you can do different things. We provide the venue, you provide the activities. We'll have also PyLadies workshops. Uh, every year we have a coding contest with prizes that starts on a Friday evening uh, and uh, is until the end of the conference. People are coding during the whole night. Uh, we also have every year CPython mini sprint, so we have a chance to contribute to CPython because we are inviting some CPython core developers. We have acti other activities like board and car card games nights, so uh, you can socialize with other people. Also during, during dinners, there's a really cool place where the dinners are served. Last year we also introduced retro zone, so you can play the old computers. Uh, there's a free swimming pool for all, all attendees and other uh, attractions in the hotel. And yeah, famous people attend uh, <laughs> Pike and PL. You, sh you should know uh, the guy uh, on the right. <laughs> so uh, this year we are planning barbecue outside the hotel uh, because we haven't done barbecues for uh, at least three or four years. Uh, we have interesting trainings. Uh, sometimes, you know, people even uh, sit on the couch outside the room. And yeah, and it's the biggest event in, in Poland. So the prices are starting from 128 euros, and in, it includes accommodation uh, in the hotel with the meals. Uh, of course, there is option without accommodation, but probably it's not good for attendees from Slovakia. Unless you want to camp somewhere in the forest, so, um, yeah, so there are many possibilities. And last year we introduced the PyCompiel ambassadors, so the people that kind of uh, are contact points in other countries and can give you information about uh, PyCompiel. And in case of Slovakia, you can talk with Richard. He knows a lot, he attended many times, so probably uh, that's all I wanted to say. Yeah, we have open spaces also on PyCon PL. I forgot about that. So see you uh, on PyCon PL. Submit your talks when the call for proposal starts. And yeah, that's all. Thank you. <laughs>